As a military man, I'm used to sleeping rough. But is it really necessary? Think you could get us some more beds? More beds. I'm on it. Yes, restful sleep is critical to our effectiveness. some trap. Blind? Oh, goodness, no, on the contrary. I wish for you to see. Meet me at the Duga Radar Command Center. You know it, yes. Duga Radar? Who the hell is this? Oh, this is insane. Go meet our mystery man, I guess. The real mystery is why that guy isn't strapped to a bed someplace, juiced up on Haldol. He may know something. I have to take the risk. Sure, he might know something. Or he might just be waiting to split your skull open with a hatchet and eat your liver. I really don't think this is a good idea. It sounds exactly like a trap. Tatiana's the reason I came here in the first place. I can't start playing it safe now. I have to try. For her. Listen, you've got to temper that obsession of yours with good sense. Otherwise, it'll get you killed. Regardless of how I feel about Tarakan, he could be my only chance of finding Tatiana. Suit yourself, but you could just as easily be racing towards your own death. And this lunatic already knows our location. Him and his nutty buddies could be closing in on us right now. We have a good defensive position here. We should sit tight and defend it, if it comes to that. I appreciate the tactical input, Olivier, but I have to do this.
Uh, I should have taken that job at my father-in-law's factory. Shit. I can swear I heard something. He's behind cover! Flank him! I can use another cup of coffee. Preferably with brandy. The hell was that? Rats? Anyone there? Внимание, внимание, уважаемые товарищи! Городской совет народных депутатов сообщает... Внимание, внимание, уважаемые товарищи, городской совет народных депутатов сообщает, что в связи с аварией на Чернобыльской атомной электростанции в городе Третьей складывается неблагоприятная радиационная обстановка. Внимание, внимание, уважаемые товарищи, городской совет Народный депутат сообщает, что в связи с аварией на Чернобыльской атомной электростанции в городе Третьей складывается неблагоприятная радиационная обстановка. Внимание, внимание, уважаемые товарищи, городской совет На Чернобыльской атомной электростанции в городе Третьей складывается неблагоприятная радиационная обстановка. Внимание, внимание, уважаемые товарищи! Городской совет народных депутатов сообщает, что в связи с аварией на Чернобыльской...
Thanks. I guess... I never expected a stalker to come to my aid. I'm looking for someone. Her name is Tatiana. Maybe you or the other soldiers came across her? Sorry. I've never heard of her. I'm just a grunt, so even if another patrol found her, they wouldn't tell me. I see. All right. I have to go. Good luck. Wait. You saved my life. I have to... Uh, here. Take this. It's the least I can do. Another respectable customer. Want to make the deal of your life? You're not afraid of trading here? Ah, I know what I'm doing, my good sir. I've been trading since the fall of the Soviet Union. And besides, no risk, no gain. Sounds like you've travelled a lot. Ah, the Grand Bazaar in Tehran, Jarmak, Europa in Warsaw, Taksim in Istanbul. I've been places, my friend. Oh, the things I've seen. I'll bet you have. I have to ask, how does desolate Pripyat compare to these colourful places? Hey, where there's demand, I provide supply. I'm the invisible hand of the free market. I've got Putin, Trump and Gates on my speed dial. Is that right? What about Steve Jobs? What? Yeah, him too. Of course. Anyway, money makes the world go round. But bartering is also good. You want to trade? Good luck building your fort. <laughs> hmm. This Kozlov guy seems to be important. Perhaps I should meet with him and ask about Tatiana.
I can't shoot a dog. I, I just can't. Look, it isn't easy. I get it. But these animals will die anyways. And in the meantime, they're spreading radiation everywhere. It's a mercy. I just... I can't believe this whole fucking disaster. Someone screwed up. Bad. They should have to answer for it. Let the party leaders handle all of that. We've got our own job to do. There. Why are you motoring here? Easy. I'm just looking for some parts. What? Speak louder. I'm looking for some parts. Stop yelling. It's not safe here. Why isn't it safe? What kind of question is that? NKVD, of course. NKVD? The secret Soviet police? These bastards came around here snooping. They arrested my sister-in-law for being a kulak. And she only has two cows. Two fucking cows, goddammit. The NKVD doesn't exist anymore. You don't need to worry about them. Yes, yes. Yes, your is a piece of shit. His goons are persecuting everyone. Even decorated war heroes like myself. Duh. Oh, my. What? You've got to speak louder, lad. My hearing is not so good anymore after some fritz threw a grenade into my bunker. Uh, do... do you have anything to trade? Perhaps some parts? Why didn't you ask sooner? Of course I do. I'll trade you junk for some bullets. I need to arm myself in case the NKVD comes back. See you later. See you later. What? You'll never find her. Leave this place.
Hey, Igor. Can we talk? Sure. What's up? I've seen some weird shit in my time. I just can't get used to being inside... How to put it? Inside the space-time tunnel, connecting singularities. You're doing it again. Doing what? Using fancy science jargon that means nothing to me. I'm not a scientist. Sorry, force of habit. The physics of this phenomena is very complex, even for me. Trust me on that. Or maybe you're just keeping things from us. <laughs> Ridiculous. Why would I do that? Because knowledge is power. Or maybe because this thing, this Chernobylite, might open a gate to hell. And you don't want anyone to know. Still ridiculous. Is it? You're like a sorcerer holding a key to the mystery of the world. Who knows? Maybe you'll end up a prophet, the time-traveling mystic of the zone. I believe in science, not magic. To the common man, it might as well be the same thing, my friend. Can we swap some stuff? Sure, but if... What's going on? 